Hi guys, Jalen here. Anyang, hola, bon dia, bonjour, ciao. Welcome to part two of our idioms series. Now get your notebook and we're gonna get right to it. Our first idiom for today is hit the nail on the head. Now this is a great one when someone says or does something so precisely or maybe they communicate a point just perfectly so it's understood, then they've hit the nail on the head. This is actually a common phrase in multiple languages. For example, in Latin, the phrase is rem acu tetagisti, and this means they touch the matter with a needle, which is very precise. <laughs> so it's the same similar idea. They've, they've hit the nail on the head in English. All right, our second phrase for today or idiom for today is drive that point home. Now this can kind of have a couple of ways that you can use it. The first way is when someone is really overly, almost forcefully communicating a point. They just really are driving that point home and maybe too much. And you could see it in a political debate perhaps or when someone repeats themselves about the same thing over and over again then maybe they're driving the point home a little too much. <laughs> now, the second way you could use drive that point home is maybe you really believe in what someone's saying and they're really saying it well and they're really hitting that nail on the head. Then you could say, yes, take that home. Take that, that point home, drive it home. Like in baseball, you're running towards home base. So it could be used in a more cheerful, cheering on sense. So I hope these are useful. Thank you for watching, liking, subscribing, and let me also take a moment to wish you a very healthy and happy new year. Thanks for watching. Peace.